Hold on, then you. I am not messing around. That was that such a hard does. pull. Yes, that is exactly what he I am does. over it. Like, put them in that like, it like hurt my hand. Yeah. You have to have that attitude. Yeah. What makes us think if he, if we're, if he's in front of us and he's not being great here or, yeah. or in your driveway, what's a well, hundred yards when he sees that dog? Yeah. If you haven't got control early. Okay. I know. That's I, the hard time. Is I like, think, okay, we're gonna go on a walk, and this is how long it's gonna be, and this is how much, how, how far we're gonna go, and you kind of have that Stop. in your mind. But I'm that's, listening. you know, I think I gotta get the walking down first. Before I can have that in my mind, yeah. right? So, you know, now you're going to a new area. And he's going to leave you, and yeah. we're going to stop all day. Nice. We're going to stop all day, and if he's with you and he's checking in with you, we will keep walking. And if he's not, we will be stopping. There's no way else to say it. No cars. Ready, stop. It's called a tester stop. Okay, uh, less pulley. I, we're gonna get this less pulliness down somehow. Stop. Okay, walk. I like, it didn't work as well, but it was less pulley. Stop. Oh, I have a dog who's with me. Stop. Walk. Why are you looking at me? Stop. Walk. Stop. He's with you. Walk. We will stop so many darn times. I stop all day. Oh, that was a good one. He was definitely leaving you and it was a pretty good correction. Now he's with you. Anything beyond this is a stop. Now it's a stop. Perfect. Okay, I want you to add a turn in there. Because it's just basically a bink, maybe know where mommy is, sit. Bink, maybe know where mommy is, sit. Like it's all this way. So you're gonna implement the pop in with the turn. You're not gonna pop and stop and turn. It's all one movement. Walk, wait till he gets in front of you. Or walk, walk straight. Yeah, we're going back to the house. Turn back. Let's see if that keeps him, makes him go, oh. Oh. So, right, knows where mom is. He's like, mom's crazy. Turn, just for the fun of it. Good. And don't get in a big circle. Walk as far as you need to walk till he's looking at you. Okay, we're gonna watch out for cars. We're gonna go on that side of the street. There's our buddy up at the fence. Stop. Walk the other way. I'd, wa I'd walk the other way right now. He's like, yeah, but I wanna see that guy. You're like, I don't care. Oh, he's with you. He's not perfect. He's gonna not be perfect for, he's gonna always be stimulated. So we can't get that out of him, but we can get control and, and, and impulse control out of him, for sure. Check in with mom right there. Walk, oh good, 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 good. Okay, turns great. Turns great. Better than a stop and pop. Let's see if we can get by this dog at the fence with him being some self-control to him. Perfect time. The camera's at the bottom now, just so you know. Do this all day. If you know my method, they, they graduate to passing the dog. Like we don't pass the dog until they're, they're in the mindset that they can pass the dog. Oh, good, good, good. Now turn back. He's in front of you, but that's okay. Because, turn back. 
and it's kind of like now let's just kind of get through it. Walk. Good. Stop. Walk into him. Good. Good. And we're letting him get away with a little more being in front of you because we're like just trying to get through a, a, a tough zone. So we, we lower the criteria a little bit if he's meeting another criteria. The other cri the criteria he's meeting is not freaking out. So we're kind of like, okay. But now, now we're over it. Get ready, give him leash. Oh, you're so good. And turn back. Get that was, you made a point with that last one. So he was with you, but not. He's like holding himself back from smelling. Why don't you release him to smell those, that plant? Those pl yes, let, loosen the leash, let him do his, oh my goodness. Then when it's time to walk again, you can let him do this, yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay, get him back on your left. We're over him just being in a ravine. Stop. I'll take him for a minute. He's such a bull. He's just like, he's like the most stimulated dog. I wonder if he was just in a backyard. Like, he's just like, like. But you know, it's weird because he had, like he had manners. Like, he's excellent in the house. He's never torn anything of mine up. He's never like gotten anything off the counters. So it's just weird. I can't figure out like where he came from. Yeah, it's tough you to say. Know? Some dogs are just made like this too. Yeah. Just like uh, everything comes from smelling and peeing. So like that whole thing down there and the sm it's all just pee and smell. And, okay, watch me. Okay. Try to imagine. I think I'll give give them to you when we get near the dog. Okay. But I just want to work him for a second. Sure. Okay, okay. Leave her. Leave her, I almost said. So then you, you know, like with these fake outs and stop and turn real quick, they just get good, but it's hard. It's over 15 years I've developed this. Okay, you know? When to stop, when to pop. How to pop. Even right there, that was a good one. I went, but he went, what? And then I did another one right away. I do, it's my methods, I do the work early in the walk so you don't have to do it later. Yeah. That's what I noticed, like the door thing, it's like so important. You know? Where are you going? Like, if you can't get out the door, or yeah. the car, you said something yeah. about the car and I started doing that and it's like, that makes a big difference. How their mentality, how they come out of that car. Yeah, oh, absolutely. Um, okay. And have the attitude that you are on a leash. There's no leaving. Okay. Walk. So if he freaks out at the dog, should I do a leave it? He's not going to freak out. Okay. Okay, hold on. I, I'm going to answer your question because he will in life freak out. Yeah. Today is not the fix everything. He's not going to freak out because we have, we have worked and worked and worked to get to this point where we're about to pass the dog. We've set expectations. Okay. okay. He's not, but there is a time in life he will. Yes. You, I would not say leave it. Uh, if you feel like leave it early when the dog's like right there, you feel it's right and he might do it. Then say it. Don't keep saying it. Okay. Okay. So as we're approaching, you're going to work him. Uh -huh. I would not do the turns maybe because it just prolongs how long the dog's with us. Uh -huh. That's pre-dog stuff. Yeah. So you're going to stop, pop, stop, pop. And then you're going to make a choice when that dog's like 20 feet away. You're going to be like, okay, he's not looking at me, but he's kind of not leaving me. And I know my own dog and I feel like we can make it through this without a freak out. And so we're just going to keep going, even though he's right. We lower one criteria. Mm -hmm. Okay because he's meeting, an, he meeting another criteria. But let's say at home he freaks out. All you're gonna do 
is you're going to, he's, one, you're going to see the freak out coming, I think. And you're going to like stop and you're going to give him a down to the side correction. Then you're going to create space. You can't do it here. This isn't normal though. You're going to create space. He's going, yeah, but the dog, and you're walking like a sidewalk, I don't know, up into a driveway, mm -hmm. leaving you stop, pop. You're creating space as the dog's going stop, pop. And then you're kind of coming back around and going, okay, what did I do wrong? Did I do anything wrong? Uh, I was good. I did what Joel said, but that was this crazy husky. Okay, let's just chalk that up to we lost. That's okay. Let's live to fight another day. Or you go, no, I, I didn't. When I was at Joel's, I did 25 stops before we saw that dog. My own house where he's actually worse, I did seven. Well, you should be in the 20 range. Yeah. Because he wasn't, we're going to pass a dog. Yeah. He's almost always bad for that. He hasn't met this dog. Tyler, we're ready. Good job. That was very proactive. And walk. Well, turn around. He was good. I mean, I'm glad you turned. You're being proactive, but he was pretty good. just like a normal walk. Okay, let's pass again. Tyler, will you be closer, middle of the street? Walk right here, that's fine. And this dog is calm. I get it, I get it. Okay, let's go real close dog to dog. Good. Good. Oh, he wants to smell that stuff so bad. Okay, Tyler, walk down there. Oh. Okay, middle of the street. Tyler, walk in the middle of the street. Carly, come over here. Okay, walk, passing each other. Jeez. He is such a beast. He's just like in front. Yeah. Like, okay. Hold on, then you. I am not messing around. That yeah, was such a hard does. pull. Yes, that is exactly what he I am does. over it. Like, almost, put them in that the like, it like hurt my hand. Yeah. It rubbed, it was such a hard pull. We're over this, go where you wanna go. I don't care. You don't care. Yeah. Pop. Okay. Yeah, I had an impression. It did have, an, look at this. He's like, wait, what? Okay. Okay, one more. He's like, I'm good. He thought I was going to go. I'm not going. He loses his mind in a way. Yeah. His, his, the nose, the nose just takes over yeah. everything. Yeah. It's hard to battle, but we have done, I do believe this is, this is the way, yes. but there's going to be a point at which he's just going to leave you to smell the air and it, it he doesn't know what's going on. Yeah. Okay. We'll walk back. You be in front of us. Let's avoid cars. Ready? Right. Walk. Yep. You stop whenever you feel like stopping. He also like gets kind of frantic. Like, like you can just feel his energy. Mm -hmm. It's like, I've been on this leash too long. I've been held back for too long, kind of. Mm -hmm. 
Do you take him to fields to run and smell? No, see that's the problem. I don't have any place for him to just. I well, I put him on a thirty-foot line. Yeah. And I'll take him to a park where there's not any dogs, and I'll let him run around. Thirty-foot line because there's no fences either. Right. I don't have any place. You know, my backyard. Okay. I also want small. you to learn to talk and yes. and stop at the same time. <laughs> Try not to get that pole in there. Just let him leave you again if he wants to leave you. You kind of held him back. Okay. Nowhere where a fence and a field. Right. No, there's nowhere? No, not really. So, I mean, and that's why I had kind of taken him to the doggy daycare, but I think they were getting sick of him because yeah. he's such a bull. Stop. Walk. Stop. Walk. Stop. Walk. Stop. Less behind his head. You gotta More you gotta angle. move that body down a little bit. Okay. Just a little bit, not too much. Walk. Stop. Walk. Stop. There you go. See how quick that stop was in there? That like really, that second one really sets the tone. Funny dog. He also like rubs up against him. I know. Not not so much with his nose, but with his like his body. Almost like right. hurting. Yeah, there's your buddy. Chester. Okay. He's like a he's like I can't he's like a Mustang. He's like can't be held back, man. I gotta go. I gotta live my life. Hey. Hey. Okay, let's let him smell this area. When he's good, release him. Jeez. <laughs> that release and then that craziness. Let me see. Him. I'm gonna show you how to release. Not gonna be mean because you think you're still, you could say a heel right now if you want. Kind of go like, oh, we're not. But I just, I think they know when I'm just like, okay, now we're walking. Okay, ready for the lease? Watch me. Okay. Then drop the leash. Okay. Okay. And then I'm like, you can cruise, but you can't do the last pull. Like I was ready to give him a correction. Okay. All right, come on. We're gonna give your mom a break. He's an, he's an out front dog. You might have heard me say that term. That's him. It's not his, his comfortable place is not next to you. It is, it is going about his business, but we have to get it to be more comfortable to be next to you, the stop and pop, than it is to be out in front of you. Because his nature is out in front. I mean, he's out front. Oh, that wasn't great, but. Oh, oh. Okay, we're gonna go down, we're gonna let him run. And then we're gonna talk. Okay, Carly.